from a real life possession caught on camera to cryptic and cursed videos. Today, let's take a look at some of the scariest videos we weren't meant to see. Starting off this countdown, we have the Shrine of Missing People. Back in 2016, a man was hiking in New York when he found a creepy shrine of missing people. Now, all the missing people shown in the video are real missing people and mainly unsolved cases, including Jennifer Kessie, a woman that went missing in 2006. On top of that, in the same area, he found a bunch of supplies like old dirty bedding, a shovel, a tent, and the scariest part, a cage surrounding a filled hole. There were around 25 missing people posters in that area, all taped to trees. The man filming the video did call the police who investigated the property and the property's owner. Apparently he said that it was part of a Halloween party's decorations. But this man does not believe that this is the case. He said that they looked as if they had been hanging there for weeks, even months. Plus, this video was recorded October 3rd in 2016. October 3rd is pretty early for a Halloween party, don't you say? It's just super creepy. Was the property owner somehow involved in these people's disappearances? Does he have some sick fascination with it? I don't know, but it is very, very creepy and unsettling. In our ninth spot today, we have Jack. Jack is a very weird and cryptic YouTube video posted on the channel AETBX back in 2017. The video was just titled as Jack. It just features a bunch of weird clips of scary locations with a high pitched noise in the background. Check it out. It's super weird and it's very unnerving. However, this channel is known for posting weird cryptic messages and people are determined to figure out the meaning behind this. One popular theory is that this video points to the location where someone named Jack is buried. Maybe this dude is a killer and Jack is the name of his victim. He then is taunting us and trying to give us clues on how to find Jack's body, which is absolutely terrifying. And at number eight, we have Back From The Dead. So apparently the woman in this video had died, was buried, and then came back to life. So in this video, the guy is saying her name over and over again to try and get her to reply. But since she's not replying, some believe that she's actually possessed. Like, she did pass away, but now her body is inhabited by a demon or a ghost who's using her body as a vessel. What do you think though? Let me know in the comments below. Coming in at number seven, we have the hotel room. This video quickly went viral after it was posted online and for good reason too. It's very scary. The footage is from a hotel security camera from September 14th, 2003. And the audio is the hotel security's radio feed. The video starts off with a security guard being sent to check up on room room 209 because no one was checked into that room, but people were hearing screaming coming from that room. The security guard, John, goes into the room and is clearly scared. What's going on, John? Even the security is scared and tells him like, John, don't go into the room, wait for the police to arrive. But John's like, nah, I gotta go investigate myself. Okay, John, whatever. There's no one checked into that room. There should be nobody in there. Hey, one second, John. Amy, are you there? Yeah, John, John says he hears the screaming coming from that room. Well, I would wait for the police, John. Amy, John's, uh, John's gonna enter the room real quick, just to check. And as soon as John enters the room, opens door, enters the room, you can see a little shadow of a person or figure leaving the room. As he goes in, it exits. He comes out and he says that all the furniture in the room has been turned upside down. I want you to call the police right now if you don't mind. He says no one's in there, uh, but that all of the furniture has been turned upside down and the, and the, hold on. He says the carpet's been ripped up and that the shower is on. It's very unclear what happened in this hotel room, but what we do know is that it's scary and possibly a ghost that did it or a demon. Moving on to number six, we have the creeper. 
So in this video, what you're seeing is a burglar caught on someone's camera. He's lurking at the top of the stairs as the couple is sleeping below. The worst part is that he just watched them sleep for 15 minutes straight. How creepy. After that, he grabs the woman's purse and leaves. And that's all he took, just her purse. The couple didn't realize until the next day when they noticed that her purse was missing, so they reviewed their in-camera security system and that is what they saw and they were absolutely horrified. We are now at our fifth and halfway mark with the Swedish Rhapsody. The Swedish Rhapsody is a number station that was used to send secret messages to others. This particular station was in operation from the late 1950s to 1998. Obviously, if you listen to these stations, you aren't able to decipher what they're saying. Most times, it's just weird, strange noises. But this particular station sounds very, very creepy. It's like a creepy ice cream message followed by a young girl speaking in German. Then at some point, the young girl's voice gets all distorted. <laughs> this is undeniably creepy, and I don't think we were meant to hear this at all. Moving on to number four, we have YouTube 666. This video is actually based off of a creepy pasta and urban legend surrounding the dark side of YouTube. So legend goes that there is a cursed YouTube channel out there and you can access it by typing youtube.com slash 666 into your browser. At first, a creepy message will appear saying that this user does not exist or that their account is now suspended. All you gotta do is then keep refreshing the page. I don't know why I'm telling you this, don't do this. If you do it enough times, the link will work and you'll be able to watch a number of creepy and haunted videos. Now, they're pretty disturbing, so believe me, you do not want to check this out. And at number three, we have Maura Murray. On February 9th of 2004, a 21-year-old nursing student named Maura Murray went missing and to this day has never been found. And there are some really weird and creepy circumstances surrounding her disappearance. For example, she emailed her professors before going missing to say that she would be away for the week due to a death in the family. But this was a lie, there was never a death in the family. She was then in a car accident the night that she went missing and witnesses explained very strange behavior and she would not call for help. When neighbors did call the police, by the time they got there, she had already disappeared. Like, that is just the tip of the iceberg. There's so much more to the story. This video was uploaded on YouTube in 2016 by a user called Maura Murray Loves Me, and it was titled, Where I Put Maura. First of all, if this is fake, why would somebody do this? This is so sick. And if it's real, then that's even worse. In our second spot today, we have Control. Now, this is a very scary and mysterious video that was found on YouTube. So on December 20th of 2015, a video titled Control was uploaded onto a channel named Awake. The channel has now been suspended, but apparently while it was active, it made a lot of creepy and weird content. Anyways, take a look at this particular video. Now apparently the text that appears along with that creepy face is Russian for scream, but we still don't know what this means. Could it be coordinates or is it a secret coded message? Also, I don't know if you realized, but after that whole white creepy face appears, you can see some creature thing like waving in the darkness. What is that? I think what makes it worse is the fact that we don't know anything about this video or the channel. Like, why was this uploaded? What does it mean? Some people believe that it's a secret code from the Russians about their plan. But honestly, at this point, we might never know. Unless one of you guys can crack it. Then I'll be very impressed. 
And in our number one spot today, we have The Possession. And honestly, this video is very creepy, so you're warned. In 1973, this footage was found in the attic of a newly purchased home in Iowa. When the homeowners watched the footage, they were horrified. It shows what is apparently a real life possession of a man. Check it out and let me know what you think. Some of the stuff has to be censored because it's very gruesome. Like he has open wounds and he's bleeding. Alright guys, that's all for today's video. You can let me know in the comments below which one of these videos scared you the most. Now, speaking of comments, we can move on to our comment shout out portion. I'll be shouting out comments from one of my last videos, Worst Tattoos People Regret Getting Part 3. Josh D. Rex commented, the eyes one is actually not bad compared to the others. Y you're right. It's not that bad. And BTW, I hope you hit 100k this year, Lindsay. So keep working hard and doing what you do best. Guys, I have faith. We're going to do it. We are going to do it. So thank you. Thank you. I'm so excited. And what should I do when I hit 100k? Do you guys want a giveaway? I think I'm also going to do a live stream. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below, please. Jack's Pillow commented, I love your adorable and humorous personality. Always put a smile on all of our faces. Oh, thanks, Jack's Pillow. That's so thoughtful and cute. And <laughs> Justin Cameron commented, the dirty feet one got me. It's called a shower and soap. Dude, crusty toes? Nah. All right, guys, that's all the comments I'm showing out for today's video. Make sure to comment something down below if you want to be featured in my next comment shout out. And while you're down there, make sure you subscribe to my channel and obviously smash that like button. I've been your host, Lindsay Ivan. Stick around for some bloopers if I have any. And I'll show you when I show you. Bye. I don't know where I'm taking comments from. Oh, I'll do it. Looking for oh, some.